sports will be played this fall in Alabama, even in districts that are doing full-time distance learning. But the high school league clarified today that individual schools and school districts can opt out. Robbie Baker has more on who will play and when and who will be allowed to watch. Yeah, high school sports in the state of Alabama will start on time with the first contest scheduled for August 20th. Today, we found out the best practice guidelines that the AHSAA has set forth to keep everybody safe when athletes return to their respective fields of play. Of course, we break this all down in depth on our website, WKRG.com, but a few standout points from today's press conference. Fans will be allowed to attend games this fall, but it will be up to individual schools to determine what their stadium capacity rules will be. Schools starting with remote or virtual learning will also be allowed to start fall sports as scheduled, but the decision to play fall sports will be left up to individual schools. So here's what we do know. Starting next Monday, football teams can begin practice in helmets and shorts for an acclimation period to get used to these new rules. We also know that August 21st is the first scheduled full Friday of high school football, and it will be the debut of this year's Friday Night Football Fever. What we don't know is what the future holds. It was expressed multiple times during today's press conference that these best practice guidelines are put in place to get the season started with the hopes that if everyone follows them, the fall sports seasons can get played out in their entirety. We'll break this down more coming up at 6 o'clock and hear from some local coaches get their reactions to today's big announcement. Robbie Baker, News 5 Sports.